Too far off, Kevin described a room full of stolen coin and relics surrounded by unsuspecting monsters.
joint expedition of family to recover a lost treasure was just the thing he needed. lay in ruin. Serene prayers had fallen on deaf ears, leaving a voyage of hope with none at all. The monster's eyes lacked remorse, or even the slightest hint of reason. No one can always be there in time. A sad truth that no hero learns easily.
welcome, friend, the shopkeeper greeted. Don't mind the occasional bloodstain on the merchandise. Eight eyes studied the one so willing to walk into their own tomb. slowly beckoned to bestow its peace. The Bergson could go no further. The path blocked. The life crystal, as if filled to the brim with life, started to pulse. A way had opened. A step closer to the spirit at the heart of the caves. Though before taking that step, caution dictated a return to home to inform the family of the newfound passage. Defeated, the Spider King had been removed from the path leading to the halls of Anea Dyer. Although the pestering of greedy goblins might still prove dangerous along the way. 
Uncle Ben was pointing out possible routes forward, speaking of the troubles pilgrims had run into in the lost trenches.